Hello everybody, it's Nicholas B. Church, and today I'm going to be uh, showing you a tutorial. Uh, a Game Yanks tutorial, if you will. Um, if you notice, I'm uh, playing Minecraft uh, with the Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders mod, and also playing Tekkit. Woo, I'm playing Tekkit! But yeah, so basically, I'm just going to show you guys how to put this on Tekkit. And also, uh, I have to give credit, because uh, this is not my find, uh, to a YouTuber uh, named SmileyFaceLP, a very nice uh, German fellow. Uh, he's basically the one that, that I found it. I don't know if he found it, because I, I, you know, I don't know German. But this is, I'm basically doing his tutorial just in English, because it was a really good tutorial. And also, any other ones that I found um, required, you know, like to put so uh, Sonic Ethers on there, it always required Magic Launcher, it always required coding, it always required this and that. This is going to require none of that. This is going to require the base packs of the shaders and putting them in there, and that's all it's going to be. Alright, well, when you guys are ready, I'm going to get started. I'm going to do it. Here we go. All right, and welcome back. Um, so there's going to be a few things we're going to be needing to get, and all this stuff I'm going to put in the description below, uh, forms, download links, blah blah blah. So it's going to be as easy as possible for you guys. All right, but first of all, uh, we're going to be needing Optifine, and uh, we're going to be needing the GSLS shaders of. Um, I'll leave it in the description because it, yeah. Anyway. And then, uh, pretty much your choice, uh, this, is the, this is kind of a cool part, uh, these are the actual shaders, um, this is what makes everything look pretty, and um, Smiley, uh, Smiley Face LP used this one, the version 8 Lite, and then I used the Ultra Pack uh, version 8 Super Lite, whatever, but yeah, I use the version 8 Ultra. Uh, I just prefer it. I, it looks better. Things move better and everything opposed to the light. Um, but anyway, we'll get to that in a minute. So, if you don't know how to get to your .minecraft file, I'm sorry. Um, there's, there's plenty of videos out there showing you how to get to it. Um, but what we're going to do is, you know, when you get to app data and everything and you go to roaming, then there's your .minecraft. And right under it, I'm going to need you to go to the Technic pack. Um, and this is working for the current version of Tekkit, or Technic, Tekkit, Tekkit Lite, and the Tekkit Lite, and it's like, oh, uh, would you like a Tekkit? No, I'll take a Tekkit Lite, I'm on a diet. Anyway, um, so go to Tekkit, and then, um, when you're at the Tekkit Lite, then, um, this is where we're going to be messing with. We're going to be messing with everything right here. Um... Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and show you guys. Here, I'm going to go ahead and delete these. And I'll have it booted up fresh and everything for you. So, you know, don't call me a liar. Um, here we go. And now we just get to play the waiting game. Yes, please. I'm basically just force updating this. I guess while we wait, we can have some wild cherry Pepsi. Mmm, delicious. Mmm. But anyway, alright, well, I guess we still have to play the game. Why do we? And I'm sorry if I sound a little rough. Um, I don't know, I got something going on. I was gonna, rec I was gonna edit some videos, and I'm like, no, I'm just gonna... Just gonna record this video because I need to record it um, before I start uh, my Minecraft series that's going to be starting. It's a Tech It Minecraft series that's gonna be super awesome. So look forward to that. But yeah, so I, I need to do this. But I'm, I'm kind of feeling under the weather weather today, so you know it's it's what it be. <sighs> Man, it takes a while, doesn't it? I wish there was a faster way to do Tech It. Because it always, like, eats up all your memory. All right. And here we go. We're going to be starting on this one. We'll make this little home one. Or, yeah, I guess we already did. This is the one with the wonky pyramids and everything. 
<sighs> but yeah, I love this though because you don't have to. Because I tried Magic Launcher and tried to manipulate it in with Tekkit and everything, and it was a pain, a giant pain. Um, I actually almost got it to work, but like all the shaders and everything were purple, and I was just like, oh my god. So, th this is the easiest way to do it, and I'm going to show you guys, I promise, as soon as I prove to you, like, here we go. Um, and, of course, you know, we have all the bug fixes and everything, because this is a new folder, but yeah. See, I mean, it's Minecraft, it's boring. I mean, okay, it's not, Minecraft isn't boring, but the, 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 the shaders are, you know. I really feel like Notch should give you an option to have, like, shaders on here because it's just it's plain and this gets boring really quick because there's no like really just gorgeous sights to be had you know someone could build a uh, like I did one time I built a uh, what was it an exact replica of 60 64 bit um, TNT and oh man or was it it was 124 bit yeah 128 bit I don't remember but yeah it was crazy, regardless of what it was. Yeah, 128. It was 128 bit uh, TNT. If I still have the world, I should show you guys sometime. But yeah, this is boring. So let's go and make this beautiful. All right. So, all right. Now that we're here, and here are those files again. Yeah, the the Minecraft.jar we're actually not going to be messing with. Um, Minecraft.jar you really don't mess with a whole lot in TechIt, which I, I kind of like, but I mean you have kind of the other one. So we have basically the same thing. This is the this is the Minecraft.jar that all the files come from. All right, so we're gonna go into it with the WinRAR, and if you don't have WinRAR, I'm sorry. Yet again, there's plenty of videos on YouTube to show you how to do it. So all right, here's MetaInf, and we're going to do the necessary and delete it. I have. Here's the crazy thing. I've actually seen a, a, a mod that required you to have MetaInf. Mind blown. So, but yeah, it was only one. But all right, so here, we're in that. We've deleted the MetaInf, so now what do we do? We're going to add Optifine. And basically, with your file, we're going to add the Optifine, or get the Optifine. Just scroll on down, all the way down to the bottom. And then we're just going to throw that into the mod pack. Ta-da! All right, now we have Optifine. Yet again, I'm going to show you how or that it is on there as we go. I'm trying not to do any cuts. I'm trying. I might, I might have to just because if I mess up, but we, we may not. We may not. We'll see how this goes. But anyway, all right, well... Now what? Well, um, Mind Z, uh, me and Hobbs are, are still playing Mind Z. I have another, another video on the way, uh, there. So that's, that's fun. Um, yeah. Oh, uh, oh, 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 Day Z, Day Z update. Um, my Day Z is kind of screwed up right now. Um, so Origins is kind of on hold for now. That's why another one hasn't come out. Um, but I'm I'm trying to fix it. It's going to be fixed, and good things will happen. Uh, oh, um, let's see. Uh, nothing. Nothing really. I do want to give a huge shout out though to to Smiley Face LP. That German, he's awesome. Um, because without him, we would not be doing this. Um, like I said, I cannot take credit for this. I can take a little bit of credit for the tweaks, but like 99% of the credit goes to this guy. And we're still awaiting. And we're still waiting. <sighs> Does anyone else have a computer with like uh, one of those fiberglass holes in it and you like you can look in your computer and like, does it ever freak you out? Like, when you look into it, you're like, oh man, what if something's going wrong in there? I don't know. It's just me. But anyway, okay, whoa. So, let's see. And here we go. We have Optifine on here. Yeah, things don't look beautiful yet, although they're they're getting there. I like Optifine. I like Optifine in general, even if you're playing. Whoa, my light. 
You're the thing to prove we're playing Tekkit. But anyway, yeah, hey, we are playing Tekkit, though, by the way. Just, just so everyone knows. See? Woo! There's all the gears. Man, I like I like the new diamond gear that the that the Sfax people did. I don't know why. It just hits me right. But anyway, right, if I can remember how to fly. There we go. Yep. Okay, so we have Optifine. I guess I should actually show you Optifine. Here we go. We have Optifine. Woo! Okay. Uh, qualities. Woo! Okay, everything works. Oh, crap. I hit the wrong button. Well... Right, but oh jeez. But anyway, sorry. I I went ahead and I went ahead and just gave that a cut. I didn't want to wait ten years just because I hit random mobs. But anyway, okay, so. Now we're gonna go back into the Tekkit and then the or Technic and then Technic Light and then then we're going to go down into the bin. Where was I going anyway? And then we're gonna go into the mod pack as as before. All right, and here's the important stuff. Here's the stuff not to mess up on. All right, now we're gonna open the the Shade Mod MC. You know, uh, the it's the it's the GSLS uh, pack, and we're gonna start from the folder, mind you, folder shaders, on go all the way down to the shaders class, and then we're gonna just throw that in there. Still simple. We're still we're still doing this pretty simple, right? All right, and then shaders. We're gonna go ahead and open up that file, and as you can see, there's nothing in here. And here's your choice time. Um, if you go onto Sonic's shaders and everything, and find the version eight, anything that's version eight, there there used to be a ton of version eight stuff, but I actually only believe there's two now. There's the version eight light, and then there's the version eight ultra. But I think there there might be a standard in between for the good in between. But if you if you have you know, if you want this, but your computer's not really quite up to snuff, go ahead and get this one, uh, the light. Um, it's actually what Smiley Face recommends, too. Um, but if you're, if you're like me and your computer's a little bit more beefier, um, go ahead and get the Ultra, because it's, it's, it's worth it. And also, in my opinion, it's actually a little bit smoother, but it's probably just me. But anyway, all right, and then go ahead and, what am I doing? Okay, open this up, and then, of course, you'll see the folder that says Shaders. And then you're just going to drag all the way down, and then you're going to put that into the mod pack file shaders. And just, and this will read it all as default shaders. All right. And now we're going to go out, and I'll prove to you once more that, uh, well, this is, uh, this is it. This is the grand thing, and this is... This is probably where it messes up on me, but no, it'll be fine, because this, it, it's, it's beautiful. And trust me, it is extremely worth it. Like, if you've ever seen the Sonic Ethers, unbelievable texture shaders, so yeah, okay, it's S-E-U-S, Sonic Ethers, unbelievable shaders. If you've ever seen that, you know that it's worth it. And I mean, this isn't the the fully updated version, but it's the only version that works because I've gone on and I've tried the ones that weren't eight, and they they just didn't work. Um, either the whole world was purple, or um, you got black screen, or you know, it was just a mess. So, but trust me on this, um, any of the version eights will work for this. And oops. And start, start it. Any of the version eights will work for this, but there, there, there is a but in there somewhere. I just can't put my finger on it. But if it does kind of mess up, that. It, it, it shouldn't be what we did here. That's actually going to be a problem in the mod pack. Uh, I know it's a little bold of me to say, but it, it should be because everything that I've done with this um, that isn't that is version eight related, it is. It's always in the mod pack. 
Oh, man. But, yeah. So, everything should be fine if as long as you use version 8. And like I said, if, if something does go wrong with one of the version 8s, it's going to probably be the mod pack. But anyway, okay, here we are. Look at how gorgeous that is. Look how beautiful. Oh, God, don't stare at me. But yeah, so yeah, let's get up on top of this thing. Give this thing a look. And every time you first boot up with with Sonics, it's it always is a little bit laggy, but it, it like warms up. It's like a it's like a squishy engine or something. I don't know. But yeah, Isn't that beautiful. Look at that. I'm in the desert now. It's getting like in the trees. This makes everything like look like candy. That's that's always what I think of like when I see the Sonic Ethers. It always looks like candy to me. This is like a bad time of day. There we go. Oh man, this is really cool. But anyway, guys, and oh yeah, and sometimes uh, one last little tip is that if you see stuff like this, don't freak out. It's just the it's just actually the shaders, kind of like loading, and then like they you know sometimes they they try to act like clouds and they don't always quite seem like clouds. But yeah, see there we go, and then they go away. But yeah, and then so all right, guys, um, this has been Nicholas B Church, and this has been my very first tutorial, um, and. Like I said, all the credit goes to Smiley Face uh, LP uh, for for finding this. Um, but like I said, the only reason I'm doing this is because uh, his was in German, and I believe that there needed to be an English version. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed the commentary, please leave a uh, like, comment, subscribe. Um, anything will help. Just a little bit of feedback. Um, heck, tell me if there's even an easier way of doing it. Although I really doubt it, but. All right, I'm going to leave you with this side of this messed up town. You guys have a good one. See ya.